Alright everyone, V Jose 32 in the house. The 366 days of cards, the whatever it is. <laughs> I'll figure that out later. You've all been asking for it, and here it is. My deck collection as it is. I don't even know how many there is right now. I'll have to do a count and I'll let you know. Let's we'll start from the very beginning here. We have Rider backs, red, blue, black, green, orange, fuchsia, or hot pink as I like to say, turquoise, burgundy, brown, yellow, silver, gold, titanium, steel blue, and titanium crimson red. Then there's standards in red, blue, green, orange, fuchsia, turquoise. Limited Edition Series 1, which is the white one, and Limited Edition Series 2. Holiday backs in red and green. White Raider and a Black Raider. We can see that. Pro Poker Peaks in red and blue. Then we have League backs, red and blue. Mandolin backs, red and blue. The Multicolored Stack. The tall Stacks, 92. Tactical Field. The Bicycle Ribbon Edition, the Eco Edition. And then we go into the Fashion Series. There's the Berry Deck, the Lavender Deck, Pink, Blue and Green. There's the Bicycle Bungalow, the Fashion, I believe it is, or Flirtatious Soy. <laughs> they are Fashion, but it's the Flirtatious. And then there is the Rejuvenate and the Twilight. This is a White and Silver. Kind of like a V1. This is a white and silver V2. That design has silver and black instead of white and black and silver. And then this is the black and silver. Bicycle Apollo. Bicycle Samurai. Bicycle Cage Garden Black. The only one I have. Enigma. Bicycle Seconds in red and blue. Which is just a rider back design. E 1988 Olympics deck, Dragonbacks red, blue, and gold, which I absolutely love. Black Tigers in the red pip one and the white pip one, a ghost deck and a black ghost, Cupidbacks in red and blue. Those are the gold ones. These are gold seal bicycles, red and blue. These are B quality bicycle decks. Bicycle Masters Edition, red and blue, and Saddle Masters. Bicycle 125th Anniversary, red and blue. Stickman. War Series. Big Guns, red and blue. This is the Professional Series from Conjuring Arts. In red, it's the only one that comes in. Bicycle Brimstone, Bicycle Smiling Back. So I'm struggling a little bit to reach it because I have so many decks all over the place. The Outlaws deck. Johnny Cupcakes. And then we got the Heritage Series 1 with the pedal in red, Tri Tire in blue, Pneumatic number 1 in red, and Chainless in blue. And then we have Cupid Back, model number 1. It looks like that. The Emblem Back in brown, and the Safety Back in green. And this is a Heritage Design Series. Number two, I guess. New fan backs in black and white. So I have to shake you there. Apologize. Give me a sec here. The Robo Cycles, black and blue. The Bicycle Bearbrook deck. Your Murray Giants, which is an orange rider back. And then this one, Your Murray Giants, which is a reverse. Orange back, really cool. House and Tigers. The Bape deck, which is a baby ape. This is the Clot Limited Editions. Guardians, USB-C version and the Fury 11 version. Steampunk, USB-C version and the Fury 11 version. I'll be doing a video on these very soon to compare them. You can see there's a bit of a difference. Then there's uh, Centurions and the White Centurions, Gargoyles, Carnival, 
Carnival Midnight and Carnival Assassins, Carnival Renegade, Carnival Ryuzen, Carnival Dead Eyes. The Dose, there's a new version coming out soon with a two-way back design. And it actually says Bicycle on the box. It's looking good. I'm definitely getting them. Carnival Hornets, I know it doesn't say Bicycle on it, but whatever. There's the Project Royalty. And then we go into the Magic Makers Inc. decks with the Skull Deck, Black Scorpion, Black Spider, Red Dragon. And then we have the Red Deck, Blue Deck, Black Deck, Green Deck, Yellow Deck, and the Purple Deck. And then we go into the Reverse Backs, Red Reverse Back, Blue, Black, Green, Yellow. And we have the Elephant Tsunami Deck. The uh, World Series of Poker, Red and Black. The 1800 series 1800 decks from Illusionist in red and blue. A uh, what's it called? Faded deck. There's supposed to be some pale rider decks, which are also similar, but I'm not getting them anymore. And it delayed, delayed, delayed. So the hell with it. New fan backs. This is a vintage series. New fan backs in blue. Thistle backs in red and blue. Cupid backs in red and blue. I'm actually probably going to get rid of, well, give away one of each of these so that I don't have too many decks. <laughs> then we have the racer back in red, Tanzan back in blue, and the safety back in red. Then we have these teal vintage design, these vintage type cards, which I've done a review on. They look like this. I don't recall what they're called, but they don't really have a name anyway. And then we got the Phoenix cards, the Tattoo Deck, Alchemist and the Alchemist X, Bicycle Premier Back, Harry Potter, the Vision Deck, there's a white Vision Deck supposedly coming out soon, Pirates in black and white, more decks from this creator coming soon. The Rainbow Back, Bicycle, the Zodiac, Gong, the transducers. There's the Lava Transducer, Aqua, and the Fire. The Bicycle Dreamcatcher, the Alchemy, Templar Knights. These are a couple of test decks, a pink one and a purple type one, purple and pink. This is the Pilipinas deck. The, what's in the call? <laughs> Tie-dye deck, that's what it is. <laughs> From Mer 67, Solitaires, High Wheel Back in Red and Blue, the Spades, set which has an Eagle Back design, and there's Red and Blue, the Rainbow Deck, Aristocrats Red and Blue, and then this is Aristocrats Red and Blue, this is a casino style, Blue Ribbons, Rosette Back in Red and Blue, I guess I'll show you the back design quickly, there it is, pretty cool. Similar to the banknote ones and the aristocrats over here. Then you got Virginia Slims, red and blue. Phoenix back, red and blue, and this is the rainbow deck. Magic Castle, red and blue. Sorry if I'm angled. The Dan Spirit Crimson deck. A little bit hard to see, but I have done a review on it. And this is his second version, the Crimson Resurrection. Pretty cool. And then we got Anglos. Red and blue. This is the same back design as the jumbo size decks that they have. And then you got red, black, purple, which I love, one of my favorite colors. And then the green version. Kind of a reverse version of the purple one. And my newest one, the rainbow deck. Then we got my Jerry's Nuggets replicas red, blue, black, and the newest ones, the green ones. Penguin playing cards from Copag in red and blue, and Copag casinos in red and blue. Silver City, red and blue. Queen Slipper, poker size in red, a couple bridge size ones later on. Lenart Green, Caesar's Palace in black and gold, pretty nice. My Sleeman beer deck, which I reviewed recently. A Grimald. Deck of cards from France. Corteo. This is from South Africa. Ramblers in red and blue. Uh, a derby deck I reviewed recently from Paulson Plain Cards. Really nice. I like it. 
the Monty Miller Gargoyles deck. This is the kind of original version of the Gargoyles deck. I forgot to include this one in my last video, but here it is. Partypoker.com deck. Friars Club in red and blue. This one's damaged and there's a replacement on the way. The Maristar Casinos in red and blue. Ask Alexander. The Gambler's deck. Steamboats in red and blue. A double Karuna Cartamunde deck. Pretty nice. And then this is just kind of a standard Cartamunde deck. For Prime decks from Italy, red and blue. Really nice. Good handling decks. I like them. The Houdini deck. Full tilt. The A Bandit deck. The 808 deck, which is a vintage type deck. Ferguson Icebreaker deck. The Magic Circle deck. And the Urban Magic deck. And there's the back design for you. And then we go down here. Oh, this is hard on my back. The things I do for you guys. So here we have more USB-C decks. I guess you can say the Aviator in red, Caravan in blue, Torpedo in red, Mohawk in blue, and a Vintage Mohawk. These are all basically the same deck, just different boxes. Aladdin 1000 ones, red and blue, and the new Aladdin 1000 ones, which you can see is a darker color box. However, the back design of the card is actually a lighter color. <laughs> and this is the new one from Pokestar 52, which I reviewed uh, like yesterday. Definitely picked them up. That's the 1880 Vintage Series, Dome Back. Then we have Casino Royale in red and black. Arcos, red and blue. These are the Ohio versions, the coveted Ohio versions with the blue seal. You can still get these on Full Bolt Dealer on eBay. And then we got the newer versions of the red and blue, also black and green. And this is the brand new white Arco. Definitely pick those up if you can find them still. Hopefully these guys will, will be producing more colors in that style because these are good quality magic finish just like the crown decks. Then we got Tahoe's in white and black. Or is that black and white I should say? That is black, there's a white. We got the Ralph Lauren Rugby Playing Cards which I reviewed not too long ago. Bulldog Squeezers. And then Angel Back Squeezers, and that's in blue. And then we got Angel Back Squeezers in red and blue. Uh, the Tom Foolery deck. Kind of a vintage style deck. The Marble Texan deck. There's a couple of new versions of this deck from the USB-C coming. There's one out now, there's one coming later this year. Streamlines in red and blue, and then there's a vintage streamline number one. Arts Dukes, Eagle Backs in red and blue from India. Studs in red and blue, this is the newer version. And then the older version in red and blue. Dr. Leon's black and yellow, and then the Hope for Japan deck also from Dr. Leon. White Knuckles in red and blue. And then there's the Spitfire Wheel Cards, which is a skater deck. Moving along, we got Hoyles in red and blue, and this is a pink. This one is a kind of a blue and green deck, and this one is one that I've been looking for for a long time, that I recently found on Amazon, and it's kind of an orange and green deck, it's pretty cool. Then we got Trumps, ah, I can get these in here, in red and blue, Mavericks in red and blue, PGC in red and blue, which is professional gambling cards. Then we go on to the Fourniers. I got Carnival Death Heads from Fournier. Part of the Carnival series from Big Blind Media, but I just put it here because it's Fournier. And then we got Fournier 505s in red and blue. The vintage type ones in 605s in brown and green. And then we got these other Fourniers. What are Deluxe? Uh, I swear they had some kind of a number to them, but right? it's a different Fournier in red and blue. Then I got Fraser playing cards, it's another skater deck. 
Gemico uh, Alpha Series in a purple, and this is a green color. And then there's Traditional Series in red and black, I believe it is. The Cheetah Plain Cards, also from Gemico. 125 from Gemico, and then there's these Pentad cards that are also from Gemico. And then the Diamond deck from Jim Tyler, also a Gemico deck. He's got a new version of this coming out from the USB-C. You can pre-order them now on his website. Just Google it. I don't remember the exact girl. Then there's the Moth Myth deck and the Watcher deck. These are both from Mr. Action's Mystery. But the Land's $100 deck, which is a Slightly gimmick deck, uh, I believe it's mm, a stripper deck and also marked. It's also stacked, I believe. Then this is the Totals Bar deck. There's a back design, really cool. The A Amaro deck. And then these are some, oh, sorry for the sickiness, some decks from. Nanobus playing cards, it's from Canadian made, yay, and they are from a casino of Quebec. There's a red, blue, a yellow, and a white and black. And over here, we got the Texans, Palmettos in red and blue. And this is an older style Texan deck, really nice. Then we got Blades, the Silver Edition. A white edition and a new midnight edition. There's a new Bloods edition and a, so apparently some kind of special edition coming out as well. There's Split Spades, Tally Hole version. Split Spades B, and these are kind of inverted, but they're both black. Split Spades Red, Split Spades Blue, Split Spades Blue, oops, in the Sepia box. And split spades black. I'll pick that one up right now. Put that back. And then there, is, and this is all the David Blaine flexion I have. This is the stripper deck. This is a mark deck. These are rarer versions. And then this is the version you can find anywhere of the mark deck. And then there's the white lines blue, white lines red, and the white lines purple, ultraviolet, whatever you want to call it. It's pretty much a blue deck. <laughs> Slightly different color. And this is a, a custom deck that I had printed myself for the hell of it, is to try it out. It's decent quality, but the back design is a little bit blurry. And it's Smoke and Mirrors V1. And by the way, here's my Blaine box Smoke and Mirrors V1, yeah. Smoke and Mirrors V3, no V2. The V4, V5, and the V6, and this is all Dan and Dave stuff now. Then there's the Fulton Clip Joint cards, the new Chinatown cards coming soon, maybe this week. The Fantastiques, the Tungsten, the Magicon, probably some new ones coming soon from this year's Magicon. There's the If an Octopus Could Palm, there's the Vintage Plaid, I think this is Arizona or California blue and I think this one is Arizona red or something like that I don't really remember then some other decks here the Absolute Vodka which is nice the Massa Chris Angel deck and Rally Playing Cards blue they don't have a red one and then we go into some 3 11 stuff we have Sentinels deck one a Jack which I have an open and a sealed one one of my favorite decks I'll have to do a top deck video soon. Then I got the Monarchs, the gold version, because I do have the gold one, and then the standard version that you can get anywhere. The Propaganda, apparently there's a V2 coming, English Laundry, and a Charity Water deck, and then Illusionist stuff. There's the Arcane in black, white, and of course gold. The Infinity, the Limited, and then we got the Red Artifice and Blue Artifice V1, Blue Artifice V2 and the Emerald Artifice. And we have Crown Decks V1, Red, Blue and Green and V2, Red, Blue and Green. And then I have a couple of Black Crowns, one open, one sealed because I really like these cards as well. 
And then we got these Madiano decks, red and blue. There they are. Some of the town will circle back some crown decks. And they actually have four colors in them. Pretty cool. But they are plastic. And then I got some vintage type decks here, which I wouldn't mind selling. These are World Cup of Soccer 78 decks. And they come in this nice plastic case. Then I got some Golden Nuggets, black and a green. Really pissed off at this seller because A, these decks don't have boxes. B, it was supposedly sealed and brand new. The black one is supposedly sealed and brand new, but it is far from new condition. In fact, this green one is in much better condition, even though it's canceled, as you can see with the hole. The green one is in much better condition than the black one ever was, and the black one is supposed to be new. And he never he stopped responding to me. And he was also promising to send me another deck, but he stopped responding to me. Okay, then we go into some bridge size decks. Bicycle Magic in red and blue. I believe the blue one is a stripper deck as well. One of them is, anyway. I think it's the blue one. Katnik Wheels in red and blue. Um, you may want to see the back design. Similar to a rider back. And Mr. Merrick in red and blue. He's some kind of a magician. Just a diamond back deck from USPC. Then we have a Cartoon Munde diamond deck. A circle. Playing cards, these are from Grimard in France. The Waddington's number one in red and blue. And then we have a green poker size deck, which I like. Then we have Queen's Slipper, red and blue. These are bridge size. And then a 500's deck, a bridge size. Not sure why I got that. But I figured the extra cards may come in handy for something. Then we have Peacock playing cards from India. There's red and blue. Uh, sorry, red, black, purple, and what they call yellow, which is actually orange. Then there's the Apex Bomb deck, which is a deck that's beveled, one way, and marked, which is what Bomb stands for. Then these are the Royal Plane Guards, red and blue, a cheap deck. It is what it is, but it's nice to have in the collection another brand of cards. Again, they also didn't come in boxes, so I got a different box for them. Then we have here a couple more vintage decks. Bridge side. Okay, so my camera battery decided to die, so I'll try this again. I think we left off here. Next, I have some gaff decks. The Alter Gaff. Black Tiger's gaff deck. Ghost gaff deck. And then we have Ghost Rising card deck. A bicycle gaff deck. A knockout deck. A needle food death, uh, needle, needle food deck gimmick, not needle food death. <laughs> a mini tackle deck, a uh, deck for the 13 card trick, a Monte, Monte Cristo deck, there is the carnival trick deck, a deck for the intuition trick, a field deck, I have a Svengali deck, this is a good kind. A stripper deck, a triumph deck, and a fade out deck. And we continue over here. And we have diminishing returns, a split deck, invisible deck, Houdini deck. Mental photography, kids cards, and this is just a gimmick deck that I made. There's even a reveal on the back, and I got little mini bicycles, red and blue, and a jumbo bicycle in blue. Then I thought that was it, but then there's more. I got tally holes and beads. Red, tally holes, red circle back, blue circle back, black circle back, green circle back. Red fan back, blue fan back, black fan back. These are red and blue circle backs with a gold trim. 
and more red and blue tally hole circle backs with the full trim and this one's a lighter color these are from some magician fight for tally holes circle back and fan back tally hole titanium is red and blue you be a nauseum deck regular bees in red and blue and then I got some other bees here in red and blue that look like this casino style acorn backs in red and green new black ones and silver ones out now these are smith backs in red blue and in black world poker tour in red and blue rounds of black and white B titaniums in red and blue these are a windex in the red or violet color I guess and there's a blue and then there's brown then there's stingers in these stingers in red and black my original B deck from the casino there I can't see it expert at the card table these are the B mind play decks in purple and black watermelons in red and blue and here we got a bunch of decks in the contest 10 prizes including Guardians V2, Blue League back, a couple of these Hunter 25 anniversary decks, whatever they are. Silver Cities, Red 2 decks and Blue 2 decks, Carnival Hornets. Um, I'll put that over here. I'll do a little quick swap. There is a Propaganda deck. It is open, but I never touched it. Sorry, Propaganda deck is sealed. Propaganda deck, professional bicycle, red. Regular rider back in red and black. Templar Knights, it is open, but I never used it. I just opened it because I wanted to see the free. There's a free in there that's a gaff, but I wanted to double check to make sure it wasn't a mistake. Then there's Tally Hole Circle Back Blue, Fan Back in Black, Alchemy, Equal Edition, Limited Edition Series 1. Brimstone, White Raider, Tactical Field, which is open. I opened it so I can see the color. It's green, just like the other one I have. The Pastel Blue Fasten Deck, Pentad Deck. These J Design decks, these are plastic. There's red, blue, black, green, purple, and yellow. No idea what I'm going to do with them yet. I've been trying to get rid of them for a while. If you want to buy them, let me know. Yeah, we want to be to the back again. I've got to finish this before the camera dies yet again. So here we got some ESPC versions of the Steampunks. The RoboCycles, blue and black. Three gold train backs. The Blue Masters, a white arcane. A cherry water deck. Two of the 311 Steampunks. Vintage plaids. Two of the red and two of the blue. A Monarch, not the gold one, just a regular one. A Tech one, a Sentinels, a Jack deck, a D5, and a Gold Arcane. That is my whole collection. I don't know how many decks there are. I'll have to do a count, and I'll let you know. Don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe, and I'll see you next time.